very big announcement. Something I've been working on for, well, almost a couple years is finally going to happen. I'm gonna tell you about it coming up next. Welcome back everybody to Joel The Knows. I can't thank you guys enough uh, for your support and everything you guys do to help lift up this fragrance community of which we are all a part of and, and so thankful and happy to be part of because it's generally such a fun, welcoming community. But what is my announcement? I think some of you probably already know who have been following my channel for a while and, and you know some people I've obviously talked to in a little more detail, but I am get right into this, going to be very shortly releasing my first fragrance, my first perfume, and I am so excited because this has been a labor of love. And what makes this a little bit different from maybe some of the other, I guess, um, reviewers and influencers that have done fragrances, and everyone's got, right, their own style sometimes. Most people kind of come in, um, they're backed by a company and maybe they're, they work as the creative director for the perfume or, you know, maybe even have input into the notes and stuff. You know, everyone's got different levels. I wanted to do something different that I didn't, I don't think I've seen anybody actually do. And, and maybe they have. And actually there's a few, there's, there's a few people that have. But I wanted, when I do something from my creative side, whether it be painting, photography, music, I like to learn everything and I go all in. So what I've done here is I've created my own perfume brand. It's called Vice Parfums. Okay, so you can find it. Uh, I do have a website up for it now, which just has some good basic information about what my perfume brand is, Vice Parfums. And it's really about perfume being a moral vice, right? A moral vice, something that's like, you know, almost like you're addicted to that's kind of bad for you, but it could be good for you. I like that kind of double entendre where perfume is, is this an addiction and it's something that we crave and we lust for and we're passionate for. So that's why I called it Vice Parfums. It also happens to have a secondary meaning because for those of you who know that I am from Miami and I love my city. And so, you know, Miami Vice is kind of um, synonymous with Miami and, and very big. Uh, still to this day, as far as its effect. So there's kind of a double entendre here as far as Vice Parfums. And again, go to my website, Vice Parfums. You can see I have some descriptions of what the brand is about and what I'm doing. Uh, I don't want to bore you with all those details now, but it's, it's a really, it's, I think, uh, you know, very informative. So what about the actual perfume? Let me get back to what I was saying, and I'm really trying to keep this concise. Um, I've been working on making perfumes now for over two years. I started tinkering um, over two years ago, about two and a half years ago, uh, really during uh, in the middle of COVID when I had time and I was just buying perfume oils and mixing and learning, studying books, classes, everything I could. Um, a lot of you may know also that in the last over a year and a half, uh, I've been working with Irene from Therapy by Roma, who is a perfumer from Grasse, France and from Paris and you know, really fine tuning, I would say, excuse me, almost like an apprentice, fine tuning um, my skills. But a lot of it is just trial and error, just working, 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 studying, reading, everything I can. Um, and <clears throat> what I finally decided to do is I'm going to release, and I'm just going to try this. I am an indie perfumer. Then, you know, there's nothing about this, you know, as far as uh, being backed, there are no backers, there are no investors. This is all me, 100% all me, all in, just being an indie perfumer. This is not gonna be, you know, don't expect, um, you know, these elaborate uh, packages and bottles. In fact, I purposely um, keeping things very small because I wanna leave a small ecological footprint. I really firmly believe in being a good steward of the environment. So for me, what you're getting is something that is really different. And what I've done, is I've created a limited edition, <clears throat> excuse me, 50 bottle, uh, 50 bottles, limited edition of perfume. 
I'll do another video, maybe in a few days or a week, giving you the details of the, of the actual perfume, give you a little bit more information as far as uh, the name of the perfume. But I've been working on, you know, again, the labels, the bottles, what makes this unique. What I've done with the bottles is, and on my Instagram, which is Joel the Nose, I've teased some pictures here and there of the bottles. Um, I've hand painted every single one of the 50 bottles. And so of course that takes a lot of time, a lot of love and effort has gotten into this project for me because this is again, a labor of love. So I've hand painted all the bottles. And in my next video, for those of you who haven't seen that stuff or seen the little glimpses, again, I, I will do a video kind of showing the, the finished product. Um, and the reason why I'm doing this video now is to let you guys know what is coming in the next few weeks, okay? I, the perfume oil has been macerating now uh, for over a month. And uh, so I'm getting to the right to the point where I just feel it's perfect to release. It is gonna be a parfum or extract. So it's gonna be, you know, a little, it's gonna be over 20% uh, perfume oil. So this will be an extract, or I'm gonna call it a, a parfum, parfum. And uh, it is sexy, sexy, sexy. I love it. It was very hard because I've been working on a lot of different perfumes, trying to decide which one I wanted to release. And really this is gonna be, look, if it works and people love it, then I will make more. And this is kind of, I'm just going with the flow. This is again, a limited edition, 50 bottle run, hand painted bottles, handcrafted perfume, extract level perfume, sexy. It is, I, I'm so proud of what I've done. And this again is a result of over two and a half years of getting to this point. Um, I will uh, announce in my next video how much I'm going to be selling the perfume for because I'm still working out a few small details, but everything is coming together. Um, and it will be an affordable niche perfume. This is niche, this is indie, whatever you want to call it or label that. So again, this is not going to be some highfalutin, big production. Everything was literally done from start to beginning by me, from crafting the actual formula to trying many different iterations of the formula, to making the labels, to hand painting the bottles, to picking the bottle, to um, putting in some inserts that give some information, uh, the, the slim packaging that I'm gonna be having for it. Again, I'm keeping it very minimalistic because that's what I favor. And uh, it's literally, I've had to do everything from start to finish all by myself. So it takes a lot of time, put a lot of effort into this, but I think you guys out there who watch me, who, who like my content and who like the, the recommendations or the reviews that I give are going to really like this perfume. At least I hope you do. And if you don't, well, you know, that's life. Can't please everybody. I know not everyone's gonna like it. That's just uh, how the world works, but I am really proud of it. So again, stay tuned. I'll be doing another video probably in the next week or so as the perfume is finishing its maceration process. By the way, for those of you who don't know what macerating is, once you blend all the perfume oils together with the alcohol, it needs to macerate, essentially blend. People go anywhere from a week to months, okay? Um, so I'm almost, almost at a month and a half at this point and I feel it's right where it needs to be. It's almost there, almost there. Thank you guys for watching. Thanks for the support, I can't wait. Um, and look, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Uh, I'm very, very, very excited about this. And thank you again, always, for all your support. I'll be back soon with another video. Peace, love, and perfume.